ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. My name is Denj21. Come with you guys with another video. Today we are going over some Fortnite news. Some of it you may have heard, some of it you may have not heard. Um, if you guys continue to enjoy the content, make sure you give it a like, subscribe, trigger that bell so you always get notified every time a new video releases, and let's get right into it. So we're gonna start with some news that's fairly old now, considering that uh you know star wars has ran its course y'all already know we had like that little mini star wars battle pass if you guys don't know um we had the star wars lightsabers the miles morales web shooters and the attack on titan odm gear mythics all in the game at the same time in in a week but now now we have the star wars lightsabers gone like and all we have is the ODM gear and the web shooters. Um, I think this was a really, really good decision because every time lightsabers in the game, the game just feels the game. The game just feels off because everybody got so much. Like you have ODM gear, you have web shooters. Um, I'm not just talking about the the ODM gear you can fly around with. I'm talking about like the thunder spears as well. Like, I, 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 I literally think it was a little bit too much. This information was from Hypex. Um, most of my information I'm getting is from our Fire Monkey, but some of Hypex news is in here, but um, I'm going to just name whoever when the news comes up. Um, this is from our Fire Monkey as well. The Coded Circles pack is, uh, is out for you guys. Um, if, if you didn't uh, see it before, you see it now. Um, th this pack is absolutely amazing. You get a, a Frozen Desdemona outfit. You get a Bat Bling. You get a Pickaxe. It, it, it's, it's, literally, it's literally a beautiful bundle. I, I don't know why you wouldn't uh, grind for it. All you have to do is get 50 levels to pretty much get everything. I'm almost completely done with it. Um, I don't know how you guys personally feel about it. Let me know in the comment section down below how you feel about uh, this Coldest Circles pack with Desdemona. Another Desdemona skin. And it's completely free, by the way. You can get this in the PlayStation Store or you can get it uh, Xbox or PC, um, wherever stores they have. Um, you can probably get it from the Epic Games Store, wherever they have. Um, I'm not sure for the Switch or, or the uh, any mobile devices. I'm pretty sure they probably have it somewhere in there. Um, you just got to look for it. All right. So, grenades have been nerfed after five years, man. That I mean, that's honestly crazy. This information is by iFireMonkey. The last two things I probably posted has been for... Uh, Hybex, but uh, the rest of this information is from our fire monkey. Grenades have been nursed after five years to now deal 40 player damage instead of a hundred. It's a little, a little odd there. 75 bills, uh, and 75 to bills instead of 375. Heavy snipers bills damage nerfed from 660 to 630. And well, hold up, six, six, sixty, six thirty to six hundred. I'm assuming this is about rarity here. And then it, it looked like it's to one sixty five, one fifty eight to one fifty. So I'm assuming legendary is one sixty five now. Epic is one fifty eight, and blue is one fifty. If I'm not mistaken, correct me if I'm wrong. And uh, legend, it, it used to be legendary six sixty. Uh, epic 630 and rare 600 this affects all modes by the way that that might that's honestly insane <laughs> that's honestly insane now the set well i don't know how you people felt about the lightsabers going but this one might make you feel a certain type of way <laughs> the kinetic blade has been vaulted now Originally, it was vaulted. It, like y'all gonna have to let me know because I have not tried the game yet. Um, originally for ranked and competitive, but now disabled for all modes. That that is what I'm hearing. Um, I'll let you guys know 
after this video if if, if if I get on and don't see it in a regular match but I'm gonna take that word for it and say it was missing because they told me before it was gone but I'm assuming it was just originally for ranked and competitive modes but now I'm checking um our Twitter again they saying it's completely vaulted like it's a lot of mobility in Fortnite, man. I think I think this was a good change. I, like we got we got trucks, cars, motorcycles. Well, it was like some some sort of motorcycles. Um, and it was just, it wasn't just the regular cars. It was the newer cars from this season that they have added bikes and stuff like that. And um, yeah, and you got you had a kinetic blade, ODM gear on top of that, a Spider Man mythic, um. So so many different things to get around the map with, and and I think, um, in my personal opinion, I think ODM gear should have left the game a while ago, and Kinetic Blade, I feel like it should have stayed a little bit because it, it was for the season, and now it's gone for the rest of the season, which I'm not completely complaining about because it it kind of it kind of made my locker. Um, just based on how to get around the map. That's basically what like my uh my inventory was. I, I just didn't I just didn't really like it. Obviously, you know, Spider Verse web shooters has been enabled along with in the item shop. We have Spider Man Miles Morales in the twenty ninety nine Spider Man skin skins in the item shop. Um, you can get the bundle for twenty six. 100 V bucks, or you can buy each of them separately um, for however much they are in in the item shop. Um, they said hot fix changes. Um, ODM gear has been made rare, um, meaning that it's a little bit harder to find, which I don't think that's the case because I've been able to find it. But if this is a new change, if this is, is a, if this is a new change, that that's a really really good change because I'm tired of people flying around the map with ODM gear. But I, I guarantee you, if I load up a game, somebody somebody's gonna have one fairly quick. It might be made rare, more rare, but I, I guarantee you, it's go it's it's going to um, not be as rare as people think it is. Um, let's see. Obviously, I told you all Star Wars and Fortnite quests has been disabled. So if you had that battle pass and you spent ten dollars like I did on it, and you haven't completed it, then uh, yeah, that kind of sucks. That kind of sucks. Um, I went ahead and actually completed mine within nine hours of the thing about to end. So I got, I I wouldn't say I got extremely lucky there, but it was uh. It was uh, it was a bit of a journey, I tell you. I mean, they had certain thing, they had certain challenges that made me scratch my head, man. I was like, I don't know if I can, I don't know if I can do this. I really don't. All right. So last but not least, um, I wanted to save this for last because um, this isn't like really big or ground changing news or anything. So. Um, Obviously, I'm gonna pop it on screen here. This is our old um, Fortnite lobby, um, I guess, background for this season, and it has recently been switched over since the Miles Morales uh, item shop happened around uh, what was it nine o'clock, eight o'clock, something like that. Um, I'm assuming nine o'clock, um, and during that morning, um, whenever the uh, cosmetics release so this is the old one and now here's the new background that we got and um yeah just gonna show that up for a brief period of time there now this is my first uh news type video that i made that was like this if you guys kind of want to see more let me know in the comment section that's literally all i have for today until i can get some more information from Hypex or stuff revolving around season three. I was like, I'm always seeing this stuff on my Twitter, and I am a Fortnite YouTuber after all, so I might as well just give out what I can to the community 
Um, if you know, if, if these leakers are okay with it, um, shout out to Fire Monkey and Hypex for uh, the information that's in these videos. I've seen, I've seen plenty of YouTubers do that with so many leakers. As long as you give that leaker, um, you know, some credit, like. As long as you give them credit, I don't see a problem with uh, getting the information from them. So, I'm completely alright with it. Um, if you guys continue to enjoy the content, you already know what to do. I mean, I'm not going to hold you guys anymore. And yeah, I will see you guys next time. Peace.